keeping up with our motto, let learning be a joy and teaching a pleasure. Here we are with a remote teaching and learning process to bridge the gap. Happy learning, students. A warm welcome to all the students of Thakur Vidya Mandir High School and Junior College. Standard 1, Subject, Mathematics, Topic, Let us learn Subtraction. It's story time. Before we begin with our topic, let me tell you a story so that you understand the meaning of subtraction. This is Ramu the monkey. There was a big mango tree in front of Ramu's house. There were many mangoes on the tree. Ramu loved to eat mangoes. Let us count the mangoes on the tree. One, two, three, four, five, six. From the six mangoes, Ramu could pluck and eat only two mangoes. Ramu enjoyed the two delicious mangoes. Now, let us see how many mangoes are left on the tree. One, two, three, four. So, students, from six mangoes, Ramu took away two mangoes and only Four mangoes are left on the tree. Six mangoes minus two mangoes equals to four mangoes. Subtracting means reducing, removing or taking away. So has to decrease something or to make something less. The sign used for subtraction is called minus. It is written as it is shown to you on the screen. The sign equal shows equality. It is read as is equal to. Let us see few examples on subtraction. Five chocolates minus Two chocolates is equal to three chocolates. We read it as five minus two is equal to three. Seven parrots minus three parrots is equal to four parrots. We read it as seven minus three is equal to four. So, students. I hope you all have understood the concept of subtraction. Subtracting 1 When we subtract 1 from a number, the answer is the number just before. For example, 5 minus 1 is equal to 4. 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. 3 minus 1 is equal to 2. Subtracting 0. When we subtract 0 from a number, the answer is the same number. For example, 6 minus 0 is equal to 6. 5 minus 0 is equal to 5. 4 minus 0 is equal to 4. Subtracting the same number. When we subtract a number from itself, the answer is 0. For example, 3 minus 3 is equal to 0. 2 minus 2 is equal to 0. 1 minus 1 is equal to 0. Students, get ready with your books 
and pencils. It's time to solve few exercises. Count the objects, write the numbers in the boxes and subtract. 8 butterflies minus 2 butterflies is equal to 6 butterflies. When the numbers in the subtraction sum are arranged in a sleeping line, we call it as horizontal subtraction. Let us solve few more sums of subtraction. Students, you can use your fingers to subtract. Complete the subtractions. 6 minus 1 is equal to 5. 9 minus 0 is equal to 9. 9 minus 9 is equal to 0. 8 minus 3 is equal to 5. 7 minus 2 is equal to 5. 5 minus 4 is equal to 1. Here the numbers are arranged in a standing line. So we call it as vertical subtraction. Read the given word problem and solve it. Write the correct number in each box and find the answer. Five birds in the nest. So students, in the first box, we have to write the number five. Three flew away. So students, in the second box, we have to write the number three. How many birds are left in the nest? So students, we have to minus three from five. We get the answer two. Now it's time for activity. Be a mathematician. Make your own subtraction sum to get the answer 0. So students, come, let's solve the sum. 2 minus 2 is equal to 0. Similarly, you can write any other two similar numbers to get the answer 0. For example, 4 minus 4 is equal to 0. 9 minus 9 is equal to 0. 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 and so on. I hope all of you have understood the concept of subtraction. So students keep learning and revising this topic every day at home and keep learning something new every day. Thank you.